How's your day? Welcome back to Science Lesson for P2 students with me, Miss Rosa. Today, we are going to continue our discussion in Unit 4 about day and night. So, friends, today we focus on the lesson C. How do shadows change? So, friends, are you ready? Let's start. Before we go further, I will tell you the learning goal for our discussion. Friends, you can open your pupil's book, page 74 until 79. Here we go. You will investigate how shadows change. So the first one here. Can you observe your shadow when you are standing under the sun? Will it stay at the same position during the day? And will its size stay the same? Now, let's find out. So in the early morning, when the sun is low in the sky, the shadow is long. And then now in the afternoon, when the sun is high in the sky, look at the shadow now. It becomes short. It also changes its position. But now, how is it in the late afternoon? When the sun is low in the sky again, the shadow becomes long. But now, it's the opposite side of the shadow in the morning. Long shadows are formed when the sun is low in the sky. This happens in the early morning or late afternoon. And then, short shadows are formed when the sun is high in the sky this happens around noon so friends is it clear for you let's recap what you have learned the position and size of the shadow changes as the position of the sky of the sun in the sky changes long shadows are formed when the sun is low in the sky but short shadows are formed when the sun is high in the sky. So, thank you so much friends for watching the explanation today. So, see you again for the next lesson. Bye friends.